Jane Carlson, I'm Sophia, and this is CTV News. Let's get into it. Sophomores are still selling these hand sanitizer lanyards. If you want one of these, please contact Miss Wynn or Miss Fowler for more information because these things are pretty great because chapstick holders, it's great. Spring Blood Drive is still taking place on Wednesday, March 11th at 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. If you are 17 or older, go to redcrossblood.org and enter the sponsor code Carlson and sign up today. Spots are limited. For any 16-year-old, contact Mr. Peyote for help setting up an appointment. Now it's Jay Rich with the weather. Whatever the weather, CTV Weather has got you covered, whether you like it or not. What's up Carlson, you already know, it's Jay Roddy Rich back here today with the weather. It's going to be a high of 38 today, a low 27. There's a 10% chance of rain. And remember, to stay warm out there Carlson. And always remember, show your marauder pride. Thank you Jay Rich, now here's the rest of the news. Yearbooks sale ends on January 31st. So if you want one of these yearbooks, get them today at yearbookordercenter.com and type in the code 2876. Please get your yearbook, they're awesome. The spots are limited for the advertisements, so make sure you get those in um, January 31st. Thank you for watching CTV News and have a great day Carlson. I wanted to take a minute as we get close to the end of first semester to talk about your overall grades and final exams. I know that this semester has been challenging for most everyone in some way, shape, or form, and that for some of you, you are feeling concerned about um, the upcoming finals and what your overall grades are going to be and how that might impact you as you go into second semester. So worried about taking a class over um, or you know, any other thing that, that might be on your mind. I want you to rest assured that the majority of you are still in a good position to earn credit for the semester and put yourself in that position for a fresh start for semester two. So first I wanna talk about finals. All of your classes, all of your teachers will be giving a final exam and all students are expected to take the final exam and try your best on it. We use that information on final exams to make decisions about things like where should we start in semester two um, or whether you are placed in the appropriate class. So it's really, really important that you're taking that seriously. And it is disappointing that in those first couple of days after we've talked about final exams that I'm hearing some students consider just blowing finals off. So if that's you, start studying because you need to be prepared. Now, let's talk a little bit about final exams um, and what they're worth. Final exams are worth 10% of your overall grade. So that means that your overall grade is determined um, by a weighted average, and 90% of that grade is the work, the tests, the projects, the papers, anything else that you did in semester one um, will count as 90% of your grade, and 10% of that will be the final exam. You can figure out what grade you're going to get just by doing a simple weighted average formula. The final exam though for this semester can only help you. And we did that because I know so many are, of you are worried about it. If you do poorly, we will not allow that final to bring your grade down or move it backward. And I think that's why so many of you or some of you are considering blowing them off. But I want you to, again, remember that we are making decisions about placement using finals. So. What you need to know is that, again, 10%, but we are not going to take that grade back. For those of you who have really, really, really struggled and you anticipate leaving for semester, walking into that final exam with an E, a failing grade, you want to pay attention to what's coming next. If you earn a 60% or higher on the final exam, despite having that E, we will give you credit for the class. The E will still go on your transcript for GPA as a reflection of what that semester looked like, but you won't have to take the class over. So if you're sitting there thinking there's no hope for you, there's hope for every single student in school right now. Finally, 
If you are super interested, and I mentioned this earlier, earlier in figuring out exactly what you need, you will need to use a weighted average formula. If you are not sure how to do that, ask your math teacher and they can help you. Probably ask any teacher, but you can definitely ask your math teacher. They'll be super geeked and excited that you want to know about equations. Um, that looks like everything that I have for you. If you do have specific questions about finals, please make sure to talk to the teacher in the class that you're in. They're going to be the ones who have the most amount of information about what's happening in their class. We do have opportunities available through our Marauder Captains for our freshmen and um, our National Honor, Honor Society tutors as well. If you need some help in these next couple of weeks, please make sure to see Mrs. Begeman, Mrs. Plose, your captain, Ms. Walters, or Mr. Rice, if you need this support. Best of luck and finish this semester strong. These kids twist my arms. <laughs> I feel used and abused. We must fight back. Bye, have a beautiful time.